Hello, this is Tom Brady from HomeSmart Premier Living Realty with my market report for Comac for November of 2019. We start with the average sale price, which has risen this year to 529 from last year's 523. 2017 was 503. We'd like to see a little stronger price appreciation if we have a truly strong market, but it still indicates a seller's market at this point. All right, average days in the market is the time between a listing first comes out and it goes into contract. We saw a precipitous drop to 40 from 68, but I think that more than indicating strong seller's market indicates a lack of inventory. Just aren't a lot of listings out there in Comac. Average number of units sold drop from 298 to 230. Pretty steep drop, but again, I think that's attributable to the lack of inventory. Just not a lot of listings out there in Comac right now. The new year might see a fresh grouping and we might have a change in that. Number of expired listings is low, 31 compared to 32 in 2018, 49 2017. So it was a nice drop from 2018 and 2017, but we see in 2019 kind of stagnant. So we'll just keep an eye on that. As long as it doesn't go up, it's not a bad indicator. Okay, in conclusion, the current month's supply in Comac is 3.91, which indicates a seller's market. A balanced market will have five to six months of supply. The average sale price trend is ascending, which is a good sign for sellers, but it's not as strong as we'd like to see in a strong seller's market. The lack of a strong trend means buyers who couldn't pull the trigger last year likely won't be priced out this year. The number of days on the market dropped precipitously this year, but it seems that's likely due to the lack of inventory more than any other factors. With less choice, buyers made up their minds more quickly. The number of units sold is also down from its 2018 peak, again likely due to decreased inventory. Number of expired listings fell by one, which could be an early indicator of a stall in the market when coupled with the relatively weak price appreciation. We would have expected to see a larger drop in expires with the decreased days on market. Overall, we have a fairly balanced market, slightly in favor of sellers. Look to my December market report for more information. Thank you. Goodbye.